groups. This feeling of alienation, just gonna say, is not unique to our sector. It is the condition of being a worker in our current economic system. So for me, one of the most important ways that the farm worker working group resists corporate control is by challenging its monopoly over what we think is possible. This isn't just a financial asset-based asset -based monopoly we're talking about, it's also in an important way, a conceptual monopoly. Meeting monthly with fellow farm workers is allowing me to build relationships outside of the exertive pressure of the profit motive. It's helping me to build my sense of competence and confidence that we might be able to join forces and exert influence on the food system to restore some of that lost agency by imagining a food system that centers justice for the land and those that work it and engaging in the work to build that reality.